Greetings friends, welcome. Today we're looking at Git Garbage Collection, so when objects are finally removed from a repo. Now this happens when an object is no longer reachable, as in there's no pointers to it, such as your branch pointers. There's nothing that you can get to the object to from the system, and Git will then remove those after 90 days. So I'm going to try and have a little demo here using Visual Git, so we can see the internals of Git as we run commands, uh, and what causes something to become unreachable, and then how Git actually removes it. Before we do that if you find yourself enjoying the video feel free to click subscribe below and you'll get updates for future videos all right let's jump in i've got an empty repo here i'm going to create a file in here that we don't want to get garbage collected um, so we'll just do a git add on this guy and create a commit and we'll call that initial right and we should see that pop up in here okay let me make it a little bit smaller. There we go. All right, so we've got one file in here, keep.txt, on our master branch. Let's create a file now that we're going to make unreachable and then look to remove. Um, so let's do um, a, just put del into a del.txt here. We'll add that one in. And we'll say del added, like so. So here's our file over here should get updated okay um, let me make it just one bit smaller okay so our master branch now points down to this second commit that we created the dell added and we've got the two files in our system dell and keep.txt so at the moment starting from head you can get a pointer to master which then points to this commit which then points to this commit so everything in the system is reachable if garbage collection ran nothing would get removed but if say we pointed our master branch back to the initial commit then there's nothing there's no way to get to this guy here uh, and running garbage collection would remove that so let's like, let's try that i can do that by um just doing a reset here we do a reset a hard reset back to 02ee which is our uh, the hash of this commit up here uh, that will move our uh, that will move our branch to point back to here, and because the arrow from this one is just one direction back to the parent, there's no way to get to this commit now from any of the pointers in the system. So, in 90 days, which is kind of default for Git to run its garbage collection, this would get removed from the system. Um, now, for us to simulate it here, we just need to. Um, we just need to remove it basically earlier than 90 days so we can force that um, and it's in it's in the ref log um, is is our last reference to this um, and that that would get that would get deleted after 90 days but at the moment it's in the ref log and so it's kind of reachable so if we ran the garbage collection now it wouldn't go because 2a35 this guy here is in the ref log. So we need to remove that. Now, we can do a git ref log expire and say expire unreachable and say now and apply that to everything. Uh, and now if I look in the ref log, we'll see we've only got 02EE. Um, so there's nothing pointing to this now. So if I ran git garbage collection, it would get removed. Now, you could run the whole garbage collection, git gc, but that will um, do a few of our operations as well. That will move things into the pack files. Um, so, But we can just take one part that garbage collection does, which is the prune. Uh, so let's clear here and now do a git prune. And if we look into our repo here on visual git we should see that the prune is actually going to get rid of this guy for us uh yeah so there it goes it's physically removed from the system uh, we can see that in if we go into the git folder um whoops if we went into dot git and into objects and looked in here we would see there's only three objects here now, which refer to um, our our commit, the tree, which we're not showing in this at the moment, and then the file itself. So before the prune, there would have been six in there because of the other objects. Um, so yeah, they're physically gone, and you're not going to be able to get them back anymore. Uh, 
Okay, back on there. So that is uh, Git garbage collection. So Git will delete um, will delete objects and files from your folder. They're no longer uh, reachable. So just something to be aware of there. Hope that was interesting. Um, give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Thumbs down if not. Catch you next time.